Hey guys, so I just wanted to make a quick video on how I do my lashes. Once quarantine hit, like everybody else, I searched YouTube and decided to give it a go. <laughs> I've gotten a lot better. It definitely takes time. Um, I've been doing them for seven months now. So this um, like redness that you see right now is nothing compared to the very first time that I ever did them. So it gets better. Don't give up. Just keep trying. You get a lot faster too. So I guess almost like normal lash people. Yeah. Check it out. Um, try it for yourself. I got all of the um, tools and everything off Amazon because Amazon's life. Super cheap. I haven't even had to stock up again since my first purchase, which is awesome. And you can play around with what um, lashes, styles, curl works for you. This has been my go-to uh, recently, but when I first started out, it wasn't like this. I made more of like a, um, like a cat eye, um, but I've been really into like a natural wispy kind of a look. Yeah, that's the other best part about it is you can make them look however you want them to for that week, for that, you know, however long. These do generally last me um, two to three weeks. Sometimes I'm really good about filling them in myself, which is also awesome. But most of the time um, I like giving my lashes a break in between. So um, I probably haven't had lashes on for about a week. Um, and I try to, you know, do some healing praying stuff with them <laughs> just to keep them healthy you know i just don't want it to ever be too much you know but just you, you know use your best judgment don't overdo anything you know you don't want anything bad to happen that all the professionals warn you about yeah but if you have any questions um just ask me in the comment box follow me on instagram and um yeah check it out so i want to show you guys how i make the um fans that I use. Um, these are um, Bad Lash Easy Fan Lashes from Amazon. I highly recommend them. They save me a ton of time and they work like a charm. I've never had a problem. So um, I have them in 17, 15, 12, and 10. That's what I use on the set that I have on right now. Um, but these kits, uh, the first one I got um, was from eight millimeters to uh, 14, I believe. And then I kind of just found that that wasn't long enough. So I went and ordered the second mix, which was um, 15 to 20 millimeters, which the longest that I use is 17. I feel like that's pretty good. Um, I was reading about how you don't want to go too long long because it can damage your real lashes so just keep that in mind okay so I have these here and I wanted to show you guys how I make the fans that I use it's super easy it's gonna save you a ton of time um, it's heavier on your eyes so like I said that's why you don't really want to use the ones that are too long so just be careful and use your best judgment there all right so um, I kind of just grab like a bunch of these and you want to like wiggle a little bit and then just pull them off see so there's probably like five or six lashes here but yeah I just do this a ton of times um I'll just like dip it in here to like keep them together and then kind of stack them out like that so again, you just grab it here, wiggle, and pull. So see? Easy, again, dip it here, set it down, and there you go. Ready to go.
there you go finished look finished product i love them it beats paying a hundred and billion dollars um every month when you want to get them done i mean i love a good lash nap i do miss that but you know it's it works for me so um probably never gonna go back to doing them in a salon <laughs> unless it's like super special maybe it's like a super special occasion um yeah give it a go don't be scared i was terrified to try this because it's your eyes and i have super super sensitive eyes which is why i started using the this stacy stacy lash which is for sensitive eyes not that it like can you tell your eyes are still like on fire the reason that i originally got this one was because um the time on it is five seconds instead of two seconds so i knew i was going to be super slow with it at first but i don't know you like you can tell like sometimes putting them on like i'm too you know fast with it and it's not tacky enough yet so um i might upgrade to a you know a normal lash glue once i you know need to re-up that bottle other than that it's super easy it just takes time like you just have to sit down in front of a mirror with some music <laughs> and just go for it and you can kind of create whatever you want and yeah i think that's my favorite part about it is that i can kind of make something natural or something like really dramatic or whatever i'm feeling for that week usually lots of length and volume and yeah but i mean you know just don't be afraid to give it a go. Like, I feel like this is the quarantine blessing that we all got is learning to do stuff like this at home and saving us tons of money. So, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, guys.